Some brief context for any new people watching, I've never played a Souls like before in my life, so my friend Izzy bought me Dark Souls. So without further adieu, please enjoy this free sample of my pain and suffering. I'm just checking in with everyone since we've uh, beat a new boss. Well, people are being boring. What about our good friend? The one we like. Don't you dare go, Waldo. Don't you dare. Don't you dare, mate. How about you, semi friend? Mm hmm. Wow. Everybody's boring. You're not going to talk. Ooh. Oh, 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 ah. <laughs> Where would the golden man go? I wonder. Hello? Oh, I read somewhere that you can interact with other ghosts that aren't bloodstains. Alright. Alright, let's talk to our big buddy. My, that's a rare ember you have there. I've seen one of those before. It's the ember of a divine blacksmith. Might you consider leaving that with me? I can produce divine weapons with a flame such as that. Hell yeah. Hell yes. Take it. Take it away. Thanks for that. You've made a fine decision. You soon shall see. Now, what do you require in order to do this? Okay, so that goes back to 111. Green Titan Light Shard. Ooh. We don't have any of those. I feel like I've got everything but green. I thought I had one of these, but I guess not. Auxiliary effects. And it's and that must be the the holy damage. Oh, and it does magic damage. Oh shit, so it's gonna do physical and magic and divine. Is that right? Am I reading that correctly? And obviously the power and bonuses are shit. But I like that it's three different types of damage there. That means it's gonna be way better than just having physical damage and lots of it. Right? Where's that plus four coming from on the magic? Because like, I don't have any skills in... Oh, I guess I have some skills, don't I? In like, uh... I probably have like base stats and in, in intelligence and faith in that. I'm really feeling the divine weapon. Maybe not the halberd though, because we have like, kind of plans for the halberd in the future. And if the whole point of this is to fight undead, then maybe... Oh, do I do I still want to get like a blunt weapon and make that divine for extra damage against undead? Or... Because I've got divine damage, does it not matter if it's blunt or not? Because the divine's gonna basically do true damage to it anyway. Is that how it works? We'll we'll select something and uh, and use that. I just I just very much wanted to see what it was for now. So I've reviewed the weapons that I currently own, and I'd pretty much decided that we're gonna go with the Morning Star as the divine weapon. Because also that's what the divine guys we saw earlier had, I think. Uh, so it makes sense, you know, roleplay-wise, I guess. But also, I'd never really read the description of this. And I'm now seeing that this also inflicts bleeding, which I've never done. And it's the only weapon, as far as I can tell so far, after browsing through, that I have that causes bleeding. And I like that. I think that's pretty good. So I think we're going to work on getting this up to a plus five, play around with it. I still don't have a green titanite shard to make it a divine weapon, per se but this is going to be the one that we use. I think Halberd, you know, just reviewing everything else for the long term, our Halberd is going to be like our plus 15 eventually, wherever that is. So we'll maybe get up. I know some of you are like begging. You were like begging, oh, Joe, please, please upgrade your gear, please. Oh, you need it. You're, you're going to struggle if you don't do it. And I was struggling, granted. But then, you know, I got the plus five and I really released that video the other day and you guys like, oh, wow. Thanks, Joe. Thanks again, the plus five. But uh, when are you going to get the plus six? You need plus six, Joe. Plus five's not gonna cut it. And it's like, oh my god, just give me a break, man. I'm, I'm making my way through. But yeah, so that's gonna be our plus 15 eventually. And I think our winged spear, our old faithful, I really enjoyed using this on the gargoyle. 
and I really liked when it had the electric effect on it. So I think eventually when we unlock the ability to, I want to make this our lightning weapon. And we're going to have like a bit of everything, you know, we're going to, we're going to have one of each at some point. You know, for, so we've got gear for every situation and this is going to be our lightning weapon. And I like that, I'm happy with that. Let's go! I have, I, I'm going back down into the depths, uh, and not for the reason you think. The reason you think, uh, <laughs> the reason is that I'm trying to get divine weapons and plus six weapons and stuff. But I've only got like a couple of uh, large Titanite shards, and I need more. So I figured I'd look it up, so I did. And it turns out you can get rare shard drops, which I seem to remember we did in a previous video, from slimes. So one of the good early game grinding methods is to go down there, use that bonfire we got stuck at, kill the slimes in that room, and then come back, and then go kill them, and then, you know, go back, kill them, etc. On repeat. Just another thing, uh, I upgraded the winged spear just in advance. And, uh... Because I figured, you know, I was grinding out stuff, and I figured, well, let's just get all the plus five weapons I need, and then we can ascend them in future. And I have missed this amount of attack speed. Look at this. Oh, look at that dodge as well. Oh, look at this. I can just swing it around. Well, not swing it, but thrust it around, and it's... It's beautiful. And with the plus five damage, too, we're, like, one shot in the little enemies, which is nice. Oh, why didn't that hit him, though? That's kind of weird. I love it. I've, I forgot just how much fun we had with this. We killed gargoyles with this thing. I should put more faith in it and whip it out more often, and we will now that it's plus five. And also, since it's gonna be lightning at some point. Okay, come on. Play ball. That's fine. This is actually, like, way easier and safer farming than you think as well, if you've got the pyromancy, because, look, let me just get him off the ceiling first. Why aren't they coming off now? Do I have to, like, run to the other side? Okay. They drop off if you're on the other side. Ooh, that could have gone weird though. So look, look at this. I right, ignore that. But look at this. One shot some. It's so nice. I've got enough fireballs to uh, to get rid of them all. And I just go back in there, replenish my my fire. We haven't had a drop yet, but, you know, it'll happen, hopefully. And only on our third clear, we've picked up our first drop. It's a large Titanite. Ooh, and I got a spare Estus from somebody. Good things are happening. You know, I used to hate this place. <laughs> well, I still do. <laughs> but, you know, now that I know it can be profitable, I, I like it a lot more. I realized that my item discovery has gone up. I guess because of all the humanity uh, that I've acquired from doing this. And uh, I don't know really how item discovery works. I know that your base is 100. I'm currently at 165. But uh, I, I don't know, like is 100 like 100% 100 normal? So if something's a 2% drop, then 100 means you it's 2% chance to get it. Whereas 165 means it's going to be like... 165% chance of the 2%, so it'll be like 2 point... I don't know, 2.5 or something? I don't know. No, it's not right at all. Maybe it's like a 3% chance instead of 2% chance? Somebody please explain it in the comments. And I also realized that this is what my friend in the comments meant when they said, you know, greater rewards from greater risk, i.e. being human. And I thought at the time, this is so out of context, but at the time I thought they were talking about getting new chat options from NPCs if you're human rather than hollow. But I guess he actually meant this, so thank you to you. Okay, shit. I've just been informed that I've been invaded. I'm not a fan of this. I don't know where they're going to come from. Oh, there he is. We need to be careful with this guy. Oh my god! He's good on the repost, huh? Oh! 
Oh my god, he deleted me. Alright, bye bye. Have a nice day. Yeah, fuck him, evict him. Oh, why can I only pick... There we go. Did that not evict him? It wouldn't let me click it. Alright, let's see if I can grab this stuff before he pillages it, because I think he can, right? Yeah, okay. Well, I've lost my humanity now, which is... I mean, I've lost my humanness, but I, at least I got that free humanity back, so it's not a total loss. Bloody shame, now. Ugh. It is weird that, because I was literally sat here, when uh, and I, I just got up, and as soon as I got up, that's when it said Dark Spirit Invaded. Uh, now, how do I bloody indict these people? I can't use it. God, that is so buggy. See what, you have to use the arrow keys to toggle to the... The yes, that's the only way it would toggle. And then you have to click yes, because pressing E didn't work, and normally it would. Bollocks. Oh, no, I'm fumbling. Woo! Double drops, baby! Let's see what we got. Green, that's nice. Nice. The green appear to be rarer, because I'm now on, I believe... 5 green, and 13 large, and I think I started with like 3, so I must have picked up like 10, I think. You guys can correct me, I guess I'm wrong. Oh, I'll just see in the edit, it doesn't matter. So, uh, let's say 10 large, 5 green. I think that's enough to get started as well, like, uh, you know, you can see how long I've been here from the amount of souls I've got. These, these slimes only give you 100 souls per body, so, yeah, maybe we've been here a bit of a while. So, I think I'll go test out the upgrades. See if we're gonna send some shit. Hokey cokey, pig and a pokey. We're here and ready to buy some upgrades. So is so I'm wondering still, is divine Oh look at that, it keeps the bleed too. I was wondering, I was wondering, does it keep the bleed? And it looks like it does, which is nice. So we're gonna be doing physical, magic, and bleed. And I don't know if divine means that the magic damage is divine because it feels like it's giving me too much here. Like, I don't deserve this much, you know? <laughs> Does that make sense? So let's, let's get it. Divine Morningstar. And then, I guess we don't ascend it from here, do we? We would, uh, sorry, we don't reinforce it here. We'd go here. And then, do we have an option here somewhere? Yeah, Divine, okay. So now we can keep using green Titanite shards to upgrade it. Oh, and faith increases us too. That's, that's cool. All right. Nice. Now, I did get a few green shards just in case. And I think maybe we will upgrade this because I know you guys are going to nag me to do it anyway. So let's make this a plus one. How many can we get? Plus two. We can take it to a plus three. That's kind of nice. Let's do that. We've got ourselves now a plus three divine morning star. And we can also go over to our halberd. Let's fuck it, do it. That's what we ground for, right? That's what we grinded all these things for. Okay, so now we've got that, which is ascended, I guess, in some way. So now we'll get a plus nine and plus 10. Okay. So now we've got our halberd plus 10, plus 85 for my params. Is that f gonna be fully better than our Black Knight Sword now, I wonder? I believe it is better now, right? I've already forgotten the numbers, because that's plus 57, this is 85, yeah, okay, so now, basically what we're going to do is we're going to swap out the Black Knight Sword, except when we're fighting Chaos Demons, whatever those are. This is going to be our new slot 1, and our slot 2 is going to be our Divine Morning Star plus 3. It's got a little symbol there too, that's nice. And now we want to test this on some crap. I've been, I've been working hard to keep this 14 Estus, by the way, <laughs> you might have noticed. So we know Halberd's going to one-shot things anyway, but uh, let's just... I kind of want to see if the magic damage goes through the shield. I need them to block though. You guys can block for me. Block. These ones don't really block, do they? It's just the shield one. Eh, the shield ones. The spear ones, I guess, are the ones that block. What about these guys? Big shields, you big boulder knight buddies. Right now, block. I didn't do much damage at all. 
This is not working the way I thought it would. So what does divine mean then? Because I'm clearly not doing... I'm clearly not doing 100 plus 122. And I'm definitely not doing 100 plus 122 plus 110. So how does it work? <laughs> yeah, I don't get it. I do not understand. Someone's going to have to severely explain this to me. That's nice though, a 278 on just a normal light attack from a halberd. That's kind of what you want, isn't it? Maybe it will absolutely destroy the skeletons, I don't know. We're, we're gonna go have a look. Ooh, getting reposted and stuff. You reposted in the wrong neighborhood, my friend. All right, I will see you at Firelink Shrine, which is this way, <laughs> my bad. Alright, so here we are. We've got our divine, magical... Oh, hold on. That's a lovely little text of my girlfriend. My door. Yes, we've got our magical, divine weapon. I feel like it's doing less damage than before. What's going on here? It still stumbles on my guess. It's not like useless or anything. This is disappointing. Am I missing something with divine weapons? At least that one shot some, you know. Oh, I'm gonna be playing so messy. I was I was gonna take on one of the big guys. See uh see how well we're doing. Oh, I should have got my fireball. Shit. Uh oh. Hello. All right, fine. Go that way. I'll meet you out here. Ha cha! Jump attack. Did you like it? I liked it very much. So very mucho. That is a shame, though. One of them dropped loot. I feel like I haven't seen these guys drop loot in a while. <gasps> he reposted! Oh, I forgot they can do that. Little bastards. Oh, yeah, it's these things here. Yeah. Oh, maybe I got my green shield from here. I can't remember. We're gonna heal here because these guys are still very much uh, scary. Oh, I'm close to falling off the edge here. Ooh! Ooh! Very not good. Very, very not good. Jesus Christ, guys! Slow down. Why am I going in here with 37 grand? It's just to test it, that's all we're doing. We're not going in here. We're just dipping our toes a little. I'm gonna run a couple of experiments here. Experiment number one, I wanna see if they die permanently if you have fire on them. All right, get back up, come on. I know you're gonna get up. There you go, so we've tested fire. I know he's fallen, but I'm pretty sure he'll respawn up here anyway, because of the last time we came. So I think they, it happens wherever they, uh, wherever they died, it saves the location. Unless he actually did completely fall to his death, in which case now I'm out of a test dummy. I was going to try run, but uh, 
Looks like there's no need now. Because he's already done the damage. Hiya. Oh, yeah. If you could come through here, please. There we go. Alright. So we've chested fire. Now we're going to hit him once with the divine weapon. And then finish him with fire. I want to see what that does. Like, does the killing blow have to be divine? Yes. Wow, these guys are still pretty fucking insane, huh? And now we got 100 souls, okay. This is gonna be so slow trying to get through here, huh? Yeah. I think I might await further advice on uh, the situation with divine weapons. Because this weapon, even though it's killing them forever, it feels like kind of a shit weapon, and I had much higher hopes for it, I'll be honest. Maybe you're supposed to use a different weapon, just to t kind of, you know, lower them. And then you get the killing blow of the divine. I guess that could be a strat. Let's test how our halberd does, since it's a plus 10. I know it's not built for skeletons, but I'd like to see how it does anyway. Pretty good. Pretty good. Well, that's fine then. That'll, that'll do nicely. If we don't mind swapping out constantly. You know what, I've decided we are going down. I have spent my souls, the majority of them at least. I put two points in vitality if you're curious. And now, we're gonna see if we can brave this. Oh. I was about to say, I don't mind losing um, <laughs> seven grand of souls and then I've, I've just realized that there's also three humanity on me, which is a shame. about to explode. Oh, that's going to save his life, isn't it? He's going to respawn, isn't he? There we go. Okay, so we can do majority damage and then finish him off with the divine. Which is good. That's, that's sort of all we needed to know. If we really wanted, I guess we could use the fire magic too, but uh, this would be fine. The awkward thing is going to be once we get down there and have to fight like fucking billions of them. <laughs> I can hear them all crawling around down there already. So I guess the first thing to do is just figure out how many there are. I swear to god I remember there being a ton of them over here. Oh, of course they have to like form, don't they? I think, yeah, here we go. Do the damage, then do the death. There's gonna be a lot of going back and forth here, isn't there? This, oh, do you know what? This might be a good place to dual wield, because if we had like the Black Knight Sword in our left hand, we wouldn't even have to swap in and out, would we? I'm getting a little tired of these red and white round shields, so... Now, I seem to remember that there is a fire mage somewhere up here, but I feel like I need the stamina regen. Sorry. <laughs> stamina regen because I've, I've also found out that the stone giant... Oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well. The stone giant... Um armor we're wearing, every one bit of armor, or every piece of equipment you're wearing of it, lowers your stamina regen by like one per second or something. You may notice I've equipped more of it as well, because I realized since we're not carrying the BK sword, we've got a little extra equipment load we can play with. Just checking. Uh, oh, what about these? Oh. Yeah, we've got some extra equipment load. So I've equipped these, and I think our stamina is a little noticeably slower on the regen. I dread to think what it'd be like if we took off the shield. Oh shit. Not a good time to test it though. Oh, we're fine, we're fine. Let's test if this guy is also like... 
Oh no, okay, we can kill him with whatever. Thousand souls, that's nice, because I believe there's a bonfire, like, right here. And this is what I previously thought of as uh, somewhere that you could get spawn killed. Oh, hello. This looks lovely. So let's grab this. Because when we ran in here... Oh my god, is these bugs everywhere? No effect. Oh, I haven't actually sat down, so we haven't healed yet. Is he going to respawn, I wonder? Surely not, like, if the bonfire's right here. Yeah, okay. What was I trying to say? Did I say it, Joe? Did, edit this properly, please. Yeah, so last time we came in, I figured, like, if you grabbed the bonfire before killing him, I thought he'd just one-shot you every time you respawn. But I guess he's actually not that bad to deal with, so we're, we're fine. This looks horrific. Don't want to do this, but let's, let's go ahead and do it. Oh, is that unlocked the thing up there? Ah, uh, I see. Let's just let Jonas Elder this for a moment. Gotta watch our backs. There we go. I like that our halberd staggers them now, that's nice. Hey! I'm trying to hit you here. Oh god, the only reason I keep picking these up is because I'm told you can get a scimitar from them. And it might be the one that I already have. The big two-handed one. I don't know. I'm hungry for any kind of new loot I can get. Hello! Hiya, you little frisky demon. Hell, these are like fucking OP, you know. The way they can repost and parry and roll and you can't even kill them oh, with proper things. That's really bullshit, you know, shooting me from over there. What is that? Oh. Oh god, I can see the like definitely floating things down there. Is that what the noise was? Was it them like escaping from somewhere and now they're released? I dread to think this fireball is going to come straight in here. Right up my ass. There we go. That, that worked out well. Hopefully he just keeps hitting the, the edge. Why do I feel like that did more damage? Is it because I got a mid-jump? Maybe. Oh, and there's some more enemies, which I've probably aggroed, right? Oh, sorry, I thought I, the fireball was coming my way. Yes. Who else is here? I can hear someone shooting at me. That's nice. Get him down. Oh! Okay. What happened to that one over here? Or was that the one that just respawned? Maybe it was. Come on. Oh, it's so awkward trying to get loot off these guys. Come here. Scimitar, there we go. I'm aware someone is still shooting at me, but I think we can have a little nosy. Scimitar. Oh, they sell these in the store, actually, don't they? Yeah, okay. Alright. I don't know why I was excited. Hello, well. Oh, there you are. Well, I didn't bring my fireballs, so you're lucky to be alive right now. You never know if you're going to find some extra lizards. I've only ever found the two, so... Go on, do it. I can see what you're going for. Ha-ha! Take a mace to the face! Oh, I, uh, I see you there. Sunny Jim. We're going to have so many white and red shields to clear out. Come on! Scimitars, even. Why am I still picking them up? It's because you never know if there's going to be another drop. That's why.
Oh, okay, fine. I'll go the long way. Shield out, because it's dark and disturbing. Is that glowing eyes over there? I feel like it absolutely was. Oh, it's candles. Oh. Alright, much better. Much better. I prefer that. Hey, there were some eyes, though. This is a little cramped. Fighting in here. I want to get too ahead of myself. Gotta remember we're here to find a princess as well. But not at the expense of our own life. Oh my god! Well, that sucked. Luckily, it didn't do much to me. I guess because I got this fat armor on. Holy crap, though. Scared the bejesus out of me. Aha! Is that our, is that our boy from earlier? I think it may be. Hello, son. Very stylish. Now I'm at a loss here because it looks like we're about places to go. Oh, oh no, we're not. Are those spikes? Oh god, it just gets better and better, doesn't it? Oh, okay, this makes more sense. I thought we were gonna have to go across a spiky bridge. Like pay pay some kind of blood sacrifice. I don't know. Whoa! <laughs> Did you see you there, my friend? Oh, I thought I could cheese it. Oh. I wonder if you can kill them. Ah, oh, shit. I wonder if you can kill so kill them, and if you get stuff for killing them. That would be fun, wouldn't it? Oh god, everything's a death trap! Yeah, okay. Okay, get away from that. Let's go this way instead. Fire mages, calm down. Let's just walk here. Oh god, that fucking... Statues there, though. Oh, and they're behind me. Oh, I need to heal. Do you know, for the first time ever, I feel like I'm noticing the difference in my health bar from putting those two points in. Like, it's actually gone up. And now it's, it takes a significant amount of S just to heal me. I'm considering putting some skills in faith and buying those miracles from uh, Petra. Can't take this. Well, maybe I can. Let's, uh... Grab it and run! Oh! I can see there's something there, come on. I see you, you little blighter. I want in. Right, I guess we're going around the other way. If there is another way. Oh, of course, there's this. Ah, and it flips the bridge sideways very nice, and now we can walk on it. Very good. Ah, I keep forgetting about that. I, I was keeping my eye on the other two. They didn't do anything, and then that third one just had to get me, didn't it? I wonder if I should just run through to the fire mage. Oh, God. I want that pyromancy spell. I want one that actually shoots forward instead of having to chuck a lame little fireball. Then I'm going to go hard into magic. Oh, God. Which way? Oh, maybe the way with treasure. That sounds like a good idea. Hello! Yeah, sometimes that, like, gets them in one mace flow, and sometimes it's two. Oh, I know, I know, you're gonna hit me. Can we walk to the side of it? We can. Oh, oh, it activates when you... Oh, yeah. Wow, he's really... Oh, he's thrusting right at me, isn't he? Saucy little bastard. And now we're in the hellhole. So let's even the playing field a bit.
Aha! Oh, it goes down more. Eesh. Oof, oof. Candles there. I want to. I kind of want to grab the treasure, you know. I know I should probably be prioritizing the bonfire, but you know, while we're here. Ooh. That power attack actually did something, you know, I like that. Ooh! And this is an accidental backstab. Very nice. Aha! Alright, we're doing okay. You guys are cunts though, I can see that. What if we like Oh Yeah, roll in. And then back out! Oh -ho -ho! There we go. That's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. Because it's so dark, I'm going to forget that you can go down. Oh, I, oh, I, was say, I thought there was another way to go. But all right, if this is the only way, then I guess it makes it simpler, doesn't it? Although, oh, I bet that takes us all the way down, like off the side of the cliff. You, you can look down at Firelink, so we're going to save that. Sorry if this is the wrong way, but I think this will be... The bonfire, if I go this way, right? Oh, uh, why is this laid out this way? Are these just graves, or is something gonna ambush me here? Oh, wait a minute. <gasps> ah! Okay, nobody address the way I just screamed. Yo, are those the lizards? Let's just clear out all this McGubbins. Now, the awkward thing here is I need both the weapons I currently have equipped in order to survive. But I guess the one we need most of all is the mace. So we're going to toggle out this for now. Oh, you're such a little devil! I kind of want to get closer because I feel like it's going to start walking away from me and then skedaddle. Oh, or that's going to fuck me. Ugh. You are joking. There we go, there we go. I thought there were two of these, but I'm only seeing one. White. Oh, nice. We've got a white and two twinkling. Twinkle, twinkly? Why can't I. There we go. Pata! I guess it was just one, so we'll safely swap back to the helmet now, I think. I bet the first one's a trap to make you roll, and then it's the second one. Yeah, see? I've played games. Did you know I'm a game developer? You do now. Hiya! Oh! Oh! Every step could be your last. Oh, and it's a ladder! Oh, I almost... I was going to start rolling into walls thinking they were, there was going to be an illusionary one. But this works fine too. That's the way. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I like it. Bam, 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 bam. Come at me, mother lovers. Where are you? Wait, where am I? Do I need to fall down another hole? Ah, yes, is the answer. Oh, no, it's the wrong hole, though. Alright, so I guess I have to keep going round and round until we find the right one. I guess there's always the option as well of uh, just kind of rolling off the side. Oh, I see some white traversal light over that way. Oh, and some stairs this way. Alright, let's try get to the bonfire first before we try all this shenanigan crap. Alright, so this one wasn't it. Oh, maybe there's only ever one. Maybe it's always, like, the front left. In which case, there's nowhere else to go but down from here. I, I mean, I could always try jumping off the step, uh, off the bridge like I just suggested. But, uh, let's play it properly. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, one of you just fell to your deaths. Oh, steady on. Oh, fuck. I thought that was going to be a drop then. I was a little bit nervous. No, I was trying to read the message. Oh, shit. Is it a trap? 
Okay, it's hopefully not a trap. Don't know what that did though. Just keep going down, eh? Unless down is death, in which case I might skip. <laughs> so we're gonna walk back up and hope that we've unlocked something. That song is stuck in my head now. Do 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 do. Was this open before? My guess is not. Oh, and those are the steps that I was going to jump down from the bridge. Ah, uh, see. Is there anything over here? Now we know terrain can fall. I'm a little dubious about walking onto this, but I guess it's fine. And then we'll go right here. Hopefully take us out onto that other ledge. Yeah, and I reckon this takes us to the bonfire. Lovely. Oh, and there's another bridge there, which will be... The lever that's up there, right? I'm guessing. Is it though? It is! There was a cost to pay for it, but hey, let's get a bonf bonfire first. I'm trying to. Oh, there we go. Try up. Alright, this was unhelpful. I believed in it, it let me down. Oh, wait a minute, this isn't the bon- Oh, maybe the bonfire's through there, ah, uh, okay. Well, let's grab this. There goes that bridge, very nice. I should have just rolled, really. But I was worried it was going to be a trap. And there we are! Easy peasy. Of course, we to level up. Oh, oh, and I've just respawned everything too. Christ on a bike. Now, the million dollar question is, do we even want to see what that boss is? Do we want to have a peek at it? We're risking a lot right now. Where are our skeletons? Aha! Swinging around. Look at you go, son. What a shame that when you're in pieces it doesn't stop me killing you. Shame for you, that is. Wow, there's so many of these fucking guys around here still. These floaty heads. Yeah, I don't... This could be really suicidal here. You know what I'm feeling is... Ouch. Okay, jump is not a dodge. I'm thinking just to minimise what we're losing. What I want to do is this. There we go. And then Kindle. Yep. Very nice. That'll give us our 10 Estus. I think we've repaired all we can, right? Ah, uh, maybe not. I'm, what I'm thinking is, if it is a boss door, there'll hopefully be a summon sign outside of it, right? So if there's no summon sign, I think it means it's just a regular white light and not a boss room. Ah, the theory. The theory holds up. Where am I hearing you all freak out, though? Oh, shit. And why is your tricks, mage? Oh, and you, skeleton. Go on, fall down. Oh, I guess it's not that far for you to fall. Little divine plunge there. There was a mage up there, right? Is he running down to me? Is his AI making do suboptimal plays? The hell is that noise? Treasure, yeah, I bet. Ugh. Can we use the camera to see out there? Like fucking barely. <laughs> now, this would it would really suck to be invaded around here. Oh my god, there's like a whole army of people waiting for us. Let's aggro some of these. And then we can dispose of them. Very good. Oh boy, oh boy. We've... Here comes the welcome party. Ah, now we're getting shot. Oh, that wasn't right at all. Oh my god, that mage came from somewhere.
Where is he? He's just watching from somewhere, I guess. Yeah, he's fucking right there. I might have to swap to the bow or something. Or just brave it, I guess. That could work too. Where'd these guys go? Very nice. Now, how are we going to get up to it? Yes, I can see there's like some kind of bullshit here. Oh, wow, okay. He's just kind of stood there. Alright. I should have swapped to my fireball while I was back at the bonfire. God damn it. Something's going on here. Something fishy. I want to trigger you and then run away. Something's not right about this big open space. I don't like it. You guys get me, right? That was an interesting little maneuver there. That's what happens now. Do we just keep going down? Well, I guess if we keep going down that way, I may as well try out that little pitfall way. Eh? Shit me. There's nothing I'd love more than to drop a prism stone here. But this guy's screwing with me. It's not even any stairs, is there? Yeah, no, it's a death trap. I'll tell you what we will do, though. We'll longbow it up. Where's the, uh, where's the mage? There he is. This sucks. Alright, throw your fireball. There we go. Now throw another one. Ah, shit. I need to like look around, make sure I'm not gonna dive off a cliff here. This camera angle sucks, can't see shit. Does he run out of mana? What's going on here? Oh no, there's loot! Oh, that really hurts! What could it be? Oh god damn it, do I have to jump down there? If I go to a bonfire right now, will the loot stay or will it respawn the, lo the loot? Oh god. Oh, I hate it all so much. Do I believe treasure ahead? We've missed out on stuff before from being too skeptical. Take out that guy first. Oh, it's okay down here. Okay. Okay, we're in good shape. We're in good shape. Ah, the stairs too. I like that. I like that a lot. We're just waiting for this other guy to respawn so he doesn't come up behind us. Or did he... is he glitched? Did we kill him with this? I didn't think we did. But okay, round two. Or phase two, step two. Something... Oh! Oh my god, you look like a werewolf in the dark, man. I did not think you were a skeleton when you jumped down. I was trying to do a jump attack. Oh, no. Okay, we're fine. What was that message that just came up? Was it just a bloodstain? I hope it was. Because this is not the place for an invasion, if that's what that was. I did not see. Forgive me. I did not see it. Ah! What is it? What do you want? Or was that an effect that was just supposed to play when the big skeleton popped down? Dark Moon Seance, Seance Ring. Now that's cool and all, but how the hell do I get up to where the mage was? There must be a ladder somewhere, right? Oh, shit, it's right. Oh, I thought something fell down. But did it actually pop out here and I'm just blind? I think I'm blind. All right, well, before we go through, Seance Ring sounds sufficiently ghostly, so let's have a look at what we're missing here. <gasps> I've been wearing the wrong ring. That's additional achievement slots. Yo, how many? Just one. I think it's still cool. Ideas going on a date last one. Sunlight grants additional magic achievement slots. Dark Sun. Gwendolyn is the only remaining deity in Anor Londo. His followers are few, but their tasks are of vital importance. 
I prefer the wolf. That's just me. Nothing too spooky here. Except for that noise. That shit. That's really shit timing. Did I say Lawtrek? I'm being invaded by Lawtrek? Oh, I hate this. I hope it's not another fucking mage. This is shit. I gotta just sit here and wait like an asshole. Just probably heal up. Get every last scrap that I can. It's not behind me, is it? That'd be so fucking awful. I'm getting quiet now. This is my heart pumping again. It was fine earlier because I wasn't expecting to win anyway and I was next to a bonfire. Mind you, I was next to a bonfire when I killed that guy in PvP too. What is protocol here? Is he triggering shit in my world now? Is he triggering like traps and enemies and crap? Because I can hear crumbling. I hope he doesn't take my loot. Oh, God damn it! I don't know what's possible in PvP. Did it say Lord Trek? I swear to God it did. I'm kind of rushing up here now because I want to get to the goods. Skull Lantern. Okay. I'm assuming that's what came from the uh, the mage I killed. Dark spirit invaded. Don't I have an item to dispel like a dark spirit? I just I don't want to use it right now in case he comes up behind me. Oh, that's a fucking. Is he up there? Maybe. <gasps> oh, I'm getting so freaked out. You know what? I'll go up. I just hope he's not also up. Don't be up. Okay. I am not against uh, playing dishonorably against this guy. If he comes up this ladder, I'm hitting him on the ladder. He is, he's coming up the ladder. Oh, I deserve that. Well, there you go. I feel like a huge dummy. Yes. Indict. Indicate. In, in, invict. Whatever it was. Oh, shit me. Right, we got a lot of ground to recover. At least the mage doesn't respawn, I don't think. Oh my god. Boys, please. I'm going to do this now, just to fucking even a score. Oh, he died. Is it because I did majority divine damage? I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. There we go, a nice little plunge attack. Where are you, big guy? There you are. I like that I can block this guy at least, you know? That's nice. For how big and massive he is. Oh shit, I got a neck shot. Eesh. Oh, and these skeletons are worth 800, which is nice too. You know, we never did read the description of that lantern. I assume it's going to be like a, a spell thing, right? Yeah, 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 skull lantern. Skull lantern of the catacombs, necromancer. Droops from his long beard locks. This lantern alights the Tomb of the Giants. He turns light, devouring the domain of death. Also serves as a fire damage strike weapon. Oh! Hold on, can I like... Does this work? Like an upgraded version of what I have? No. <laughs> Let's get back to what's important. My corpse. Kind of relieved to not be human anymore, to be honest. Because I can live without the anticipation of constantly being invaded. Sorry, I've noticed my body's not here, but then I've also just realised it'll be up there, won't it? It'll be wherever you fell from, usually. Because I think I died from the full damage. Oh, he died! Anyway! Okay, I'm, I'm losing sight of the rules here for which skeletons you can and can't kill with a divine weapon. Because I know there are different types, because obviously there's ones in the graveyards you can kill with anything, and then there's ones here, which I thought you had to kill with a divine. Liarhead! Ah. Can't wait for this spot of fun. Ooh! Tranquil walk of peace. Far into the way of the white. Slows a walking within area. This miracle is normally used to flee. As it slows walking, 
does not affect attacks, but nevertheless defines peace perfectly. Ah, that's not. I guess that's like what the stone knights have, right? Now allow me to. Oh. Oh, haha! Oh, I think that's what he activated earlier. And that's why it's not showing for me now. Again, it was fine to kill him with the halberd. What are the rules? What are the rules? Oh, we're here again. Ah! I see. I see, said the blind man. These are all fine to just kill normally. Alright. Falchion. That's a new one. I think they sell it in the store, but it's a new one for me. Oh, there's a little treasure there somewhere. Do I see that right? There is something there. Have I never been in this room? A lucerne. Lucerne. A lucerne. Could be any of these things. So I've just missed this room every time, huh? Gotta be fancy with me, dickhead. First, is, does this count as... Oh, it is a halberd. Interesting. I can't remember what the base damage of the halberd was and if this is better or not. It's got fewer param requirements. Halberd of a large, hard beak-like protrusion inflicts thrust damage instead of thrusting like a spear. The builder of the Lucerne aims to club the head with its hard beak. <laughs> like a big pickaxe. I wonder if I've missed any other little rooms. That was smart, right? I think I'm gonna go back and uh, heal these. Walking back, there better be a shortcut, you know, because walking back from this place is gonna suck. Oh, who died? Oh, shit. Aha! You can fuck up your parries as well. Or your reposts, or whatever. Seemed a bit bullshit in my favor there that I was able to dodge that. Come here, come on. I know it's going to be crap, but just in case you give shards of something, I want it. This is bollocks. Are you seeing this? Fine, I'll kick you down there. They can have you. Ah, I'm a dickhead. Uh, <laughs> I'm still a dickhead. Please be shortcut. Please be shortcut. Why would someone be excited to be here? I wonder. Oh, you could have jumped across here. I didn't even notice. Oh, that's got me written all over it. Oh, I'm such a wiener. Something's going to roll down here, right? Oh. I have no fucking idea. Any loot? Any enemies? Any friends? Friends would always be nice. My lady? Oh, this is like a fucking... End boss room in Skyrim. I'm expecting a mini boss. All these coffins are going to open, surely. Oh, suck my ass. So we found a route to go this way. Or is it? Oh, no, I have no idea. I can hear cast it. Oh! I've got a second here, casting. Wait, did I get so I didn't check. Oh no, I think they're reanimating. Did they follow me in here? Did they come up the ladder? Bye bye. Was there a ladder? Yeah, there is a ladder. All that fight was out here where there's more space, to be honest, I think. You want some of this, buddy? See what happened to your friend just now? Ha ha! You chose a bad time to stop locking. Creep. I don't want to go down there yet. I'm surprised there's not loot in like any of these. Okay, if there's two player messages and something definitely happens here. Checking the ceilings. Checking the sides. It looks like there's something right there. Detour ahead. Hidden path. Oh shit. Are you just a stone or should I actually be wary of you? It's a genuine article. There it is. I was wondering, I was waiting for that because I wanted to see if he's actually uh, 
a lightning one like his brother or something else. Oh, that's BS. Maybe I could range this one. Do you know what? What's my best lightning shield? 65. Eh. Oh, shit. My jump attack has been thwarted. Yeah, maybe we will try shooting him. It's just now he's even further into the deep dark. This is kind of an awkward fight, huh? I don't remember him being hard from when we fought one last time, but... Oh, it's just such an inconvenience, this. I th okay, we're gonna get up close to him, right? In which case... Lightning doesn't matter anymore. Because he's gonna be doing physical damage. Now I wonder if we want to do this when we get up there. How much progress are we losing? Oh, if I die here. Oh, I'm just suddenly thinking. What if Iron Flesh makes you weak to lightning? That would make sense, right? Seems like the kind of game to do that. But like we just said, he's not going to be doing electrical attacks when we're up there. Okay. I think we're going to lose this any moment. Ooh. Shit. Heal. Heal while you can. There it is. Okay, we've wasted a uh, lot there of our heals. Oh, do you know what we did buy, which I kept secret off camera? We could give these a go. There he is. Wait a minute, where the fuck is he? Eighteen! Oh, maybe that's a waste then. Yeah, totally a waste. <laughs> oh, I don't even have to roll, I just have to sidestep. Easy. I was overcomplicating it that first time. Do you reckon you can poison a, a demon like this? Because we came equipped with those too. Just because I'm determined to see some effectiveness from him, you know. I don't know how we tell when he's poisoned. Is it just gonna... Will it be like his health bar stays there because it's technically slowly ticking down? I don't know. Or is it just doing a little bit of poison damage, maybe? I don't, I don't know how it works. I'm determined to, like, see this... Oh, did we run out? Oh, I wasn't even using them! I'm an idiot. All right, now we'll see. Poison arrows suck, man. Maybe he's immune to poison. I mean, he's a big, like, you know, he's made of titanite, whatever that is. Oh, I hate this. We've, we've sort of, the thing is, I've wasted so much ammunition now that I have to kind of keep going. Because if I go in there now and melee and die, that's gonna be sucky, having wasted all this now. Oh, if that just skimmed past my ear. Oh, I'm an idiot. There goes the last heal. I got complacent. Oh god, now I've lost where he is. I can just about see my arrows sticking out of him. I could go in there with a pine resin, but I assume the guy's bloody immune to everything. Like, we saw how little damage the uh, fire ones did. What's going on? Oh, I thought he was doing it like a phase two thing there. I imagine lightning's gonna do fuck all, because he is lightning. He's gotta have some kind of resistance. But then again, we do have an abundance of lightning resins. So we'll give it a go, because we're going to run out of arrows before we can kill him anyway. Oh, I guess I've still got some fire ones left, which I'm inclined to use at this point, because we've run out of Estus. It's too risky if we go in there now. I don't have any healing magic. Yeah, see, look, these are doing, like, less damage. 
It's crazy. That's last one. Okay, it's the do or die moment. We've all been waiting for. Oh, of course I can't put it on my uh, halberd. Eh, not my halberd, sorry. My um, my mace. Because it's uh, shit. No, because it's it's got uh, like a thing on it now. An element. Divine. Divinity. And stuff. I'm sure this is going to do nothing, but hey-ho, we're here. Wish me luck, fellas. And one or two ladies who watch. Uh-oh, that's bad. Oh, thank God. Jesus. I am deaf. No idea. That was so sloppy. Detour ahead. What do we mean by that? Look, I don't know about you guys, but uh, I'm, I'm happy with the progress. We've been playing a long time. It's time to, uh, to call it a night here, I think. But thank you so much for watching. This has been great, actually. I've really enjoyed the progress I've made. So thank you. I'll see you in the next one. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, join the Discord. All that other crap that I like and is probably tedious for you, but I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. And I love you, so please, more of that. Thank you very much. Have a good night, all. Goodbye.